Hi guys, short video here about what's in the package, how it looks when you buy the DJI Osmo Action 4 in the standard combo. I think that's the smallest package which you can get and this is as of November 2024. Sometimes these companies are changing what they are adding in the packaging or they change the packaging or they just change also a little bit the product. Of course, not main features, but sometimes small stuff. So I wanted to show you what you can expect here. By the way, everything came nicely sealed. Seal outside and another seal here on top. So this is how it looks. So here's the camera also sealed and then the accessories on the other side and maybe the battery down here almost impossible to remove this box down here so maybe it's not even intended to be removed yeah looks like this small box down here you don't have to remove there's nothing in there so we have just two items we have the camera first here makes a really good solid impression this is how it looks a little bit smaller than the latest gopros here i have the 10 black you can see size comparison definitely smaller than the latest GoPros. I like the grip, like the style, touch and feel really nice. I mean, similar to GoPros. Let's see what we get in the accessories. So here we go. Get a lot of instructions. We get a quick starter guide. We get some warranty information and then some safety guidelines and in a separate package we get some stickers that's the whole sticker set and we get a charging cable usb-c to usb-c probably also data cable and we get this gopro mount screw but not a gopro mount so let's see we get a lot here so we get a battery lithium polymer 1770 milliampere hours larger than gopro than this gopro like mount i guess that's compatible with gopro and we get also the screw here let's see if it's same as with the gopro let's put the gopro here yeah definitely fits for the gopro 10 black hero but it's, I would say, more solid than the original GoPro stuff. And then we get this magnetic mount, which you can just put a line here on the knees. When we push a little bit harder, it snaps. So it has a really good solid hold. When we want to remove it, we have to push from the sides and then pull kind of combination of magnetic and mechanical hold. Fits, of course, to all standard mounts for example the one which we already got in the package definitely love the mount let's open see yeah that's the usb port here down here again that's not an opening that's just for the magnetic holder and then the opening on the other side we have to push here in and then push a little bit up at the same time similar to the gopro maybe the opening a little bit better with the gopro but we have also this flap here and that's what's inside so there's nothing inside there's no battery there's no micro sd card but we have the opening for the micro sd card so the set comes only with one battery but that was expected but i would say it's ready to shoot apart from the micro sd card of course I think there's no internal storage here so if you want to buy this for you and want to be ready to shoot or if you want to buy this as a gift for somebody make sure that you have a micro sd card at least class 10 but i would go maybe with a v30 or so something like that to support higher recording speeds i mean it doesn't come with an external charger but we can just add the battery here inside push this down open on the other side add the usb c then connect it to a power bank or other usb c source doesn't show anything so we have to push here on the side can choose the language then we get some information that's not a serial number just general qr code but it says osmo action 4 and the number probably model type 486d and after adjusting the date and time we have access to everything yeah we have him some digital zoom here 
a lot of explanation here how to use it but what i actually wanted to show is the battery level so it has arrived with 60 percent charge which is i think not bad so it's not totally full which is a good thing to store but also not totally drained so if you want to use it right out of the box that would be possible but again you would have to have your own micro sd card ready that's the only thing it also shows it in the upper left corner that there is no micro sd card inserted and so when i push on recording it says no micro sd card as a warning but it's charging nicely so i have to grab micro sd card and then we get some kind of lens protector or lens replacement or at least temporary lens protector if the lens is damaged something like that never seen before but i hope i'm not going to need that with the gopro it was always super easy to replace the cover but i never had a damaged cover for the lens and what you also get is this extra housing it's not a waterproof housing it's also not like the media mode it doesn't have extra power it doesn't have a microphone there's no electronic here there's just this on off button here and what we have is the magnetic or this quick snap holder here on the side instead from underneath maybe that's the only reason why we are using that because we can use that then in an upright position would have been great to have a similar function as with the media mode from the gopro where we could have extra power extra microphone i don't know if it's even available but at least definitely the side mount for the osmo but i'm not going to continue right now i'm doing a full review anyway what i think about this camera even though it's not the latest dji osmo anymore but i think it's very similar to the latest version i think the optical thing hasn't changed sensor hasn't changed so it hasn't changed a lot and so if you're interested i'll put down the link to the amazon listing where you can buy it down into the description of the video by the way currently it's super super cheap only around 200 dollars which is a steal for this camera i think the new one is around 350 dollars so you get much more for the money than with the latest five and there's not a huge difference at least not from what i heard so i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments or want to share your own experience then just let us know down in the feedback area i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel thanks for watching see you next time